What is up, everybody? What is going on? Hope all is well. You said what? You said what? Yeah, because in my fries, you got two cheeseburgers. Uh-huh. What is going on, everyone? Hope all is well with you. Listen, so I got the news like everybody got the news. Uh, I was on my way to the gym this morning trying to get my little workout in, and I was hoping that this was fake, but it's not. Um, and a lot of people are having such a, a hissy fit right now, and they're in such a tizzy because you know they're waiting on the family and me i do agree waiting on the family because you know i'm i'm church of god in christ so I, I know how this thing worked so it became official for me once uh my mother dear uh first lady karen had made her post and i went ahead and made my post that's when i knew for sure that it was official because the first lady of the church made her post and um karen is very close with the family so we go from there um it is very saddening that Lashawn has passed but i will say this um to make it make sense you know Lashawn has been sick and you know she's been in her uphill journey with her health and everything but you know god didn't heal her on this side he healed her on that side and so we thank god for that um and either way it go it's still sad because she's not here anymore uh, there's no point in saying oh she it's too soon man we do not know the timing of god i don't see y'all talking back to me today but that's all right we don't know the timing of god we don't know what he's gonna do we don't know how he's gonna do it or whatever the case may be. But we send love to the family and everything like that. You know, it, it's really hard. You know, I can I can say that it's very difficult for the Pace family because this is the third year and this is the third person. You know, they just lost. They lost Mama Pace about three years ago. I think I'm about correct when I say that. They lost Mama Pace about three years ago. Uh, last year, or yes, last year, which would make year number two, they lost um, Duranis, and now this year they're losing Sean. You know, it is, it's a lot, y'all. It's a lot. That's why for me, because I've had my, you know, I had my issues, you know, we've gone back and forth, you know, me and Latrice, and me and, uh, um, Leslie, we've gone back and forth about things. Not, you know, people just don't understand or they take things a certain way. We've, we've gone back and forth about certain stuff. But uh, my my heart and my prayer goes out to the family. And, and I just ask that God, I just ask that the Lord sends his comfort, you know, at this time. It is a lot. I don't care what nobody says. It is a lot, you know, for them, you know. And so these individuals, you know to just try to make sense of it they were they were not in the best of health not to say they needed to be taken out of here but they were not in the best of health and so one we praise god for their life we praise god for their legacy we praise god for their love uh, because you know this was and has always been a musical family and so we just celebrate the music ministry of this family and and what they have paved the way for because these girls were anointed and have always been anointed. And so, you know, you can tell the anointing that has always been on their life, even through song. You know, sometimes you sing through your pain, you know, so we celebrate their life. We celebrate the love and everything like that. So, um, let me see. Yeah. So you all, um, we got the news this morning. We got the news this morning. It was, I was on my way to the gym about 10 or 11 and we got the news this morning and I was in shock and I was all over the internet trying to make sure this was what it was. 
and I saw one gentleman had posted, and y'all know, uh, Larry had posted, and I think William had posted. You know, William McCray and myself, we are coaching, so we tend to get the news beforehand. Um, uh, Brother Larry, he is very close with the family, so I can very much so consider that to be a fact. And I'm saying that not even to sound shady or be shady, but he's very close with the family. So when I saw that he posted, I said, okay, let me still wait. Let me still wait. Because I, our church, Sean Pace, the Pace family, the Clark family, are very iconic in this church. And so you just want to make sure uh, that you just kind of wait for things to kind of be official. You know, I know we, you know, the news says things and, you know, the, the, but this, the church is a little different. You know, people are very touchy, especially around these subjects and stuff like that. So, you know, with, with it being church, you know, we try to give people a little grace. But uh, like I said earlier in this video, once um, Karen had posted, Mother Karen had posted, um, it became official for me. Um, I do believe that the Church of God in Christ. <laughs> hey, y'all. I do believe that uh, the Church of God in Christ has made their post. Uh, the women's department has made their post. And um, at this point, it's just upon the family to make their post as well. If, if anybody knows anything. Wait, somebody said they just told me that. Huh? Who told me what? Um, so, so um, what I am concluding is that um, we just pray for the family. We pray for them. We send our, our love to them, even at this time. And uh, we just go from there. This is... This is a lie, you know, it's like boom, 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 boom. And I could say, I could say you all, hey, we got to take better care of ourselves. But the reality is whether you take care of yourself or not, this is life. Hopefully that makes sense to the few of you all that are watching right now. Um, this is life. Oh, uh, okay. Yeah, I wouldn't watch it. I, I'm. I. Yeah, I made the post, hit the premiere, and I didn't see that. So I'm sorry, baby. I'm, I apologize. Um. So yeah, we we just going on from there, and all of that, and, and that good stuff, and um, yeah. But I. But I will say. I will say it anyways. Just make sure we take care of ourselves. Okay. Just make sure we take care of ourselves. You know, we cannot just say, oh, God's going to do it. No, God gives us common sense to take care of ourselves. And the problem, and the problem that a lot of us um, saints, saints and friends have, church people that we have is we, we pray for good health. We fast for good health and we believe God um, to work a wonder in our life. But God gives us common sense and we have to make sure that we take the initiative, that we take the initiative uh, that we take the initiative to take care of the life that God has given. Okay? Um, we cannot eat recklessly and frivolously and think that, you know, we're going to be okay. You know, the, the reason why there is a heartache, um, dis-ease and things is because we do things frivolously. Oh, thank you, Jalon. Yes, Sinclair, she is going to be missed. Um, and back to what I was saying, we have to take care of ourselves. And so, you know, a lot of times, a lot of our older saints and Sean is in that category. She's in the older saints category. A lot of times we get older 
And what we've done for so long catches up with us. And I'm not telling you that you got to be a size two, three, five, or 10 or whatever, but you know, you could be a, a, a size 20 and still be healthy. You just, you just big bone in your jeans. But we got to make sure that we do what we can while we can to take care of ourselves so that we live a long, prosperous life. Um, this is a lot, you know, uh, baby, I, I, you know, maybe, maybe it's just my generation and the generation before me, but it's like we are losing so many people that we have grown up with. I can raise my hand and say that I grew up with the Pay Sisters. You know, I grew up with their songs, going to midnight musicals, cogent conventions and convocations and concerts. I grew up with them. You know, I grew up with this. You know, I'm me and their kids are in the same age bracket. You know, like it's it's just like wow. You know, y'all, this is this is really real. This is really real. This is real. Life is real. You know, uh, in the book of Psalms of Solomon, it says to everyone, there is a time and a season for all things. Oh, that thing just almost hit me. It made me start crying. Uh, to everything, there's a time and season for all things. So, So my prayer goes out to them and I pray for the family. I pray for what they're going through right now. And I pray that God strengthens their heart and their mind and their spirit and soul. And so, um, yes, yes, yes. Jalon, absolutely correct. Mother Pace died. Mother Pace died 2020. Uh, Durandis died 2021. And LaShawn died 2022. That's that's three years. Three years of family members dying back to back. Y'all, you know, it's that's that that's gonna be a lot on them, you know. So our prayer go out to them, our prayers go out to them. I do believe that they're gonna have as much support as possible. You know, LaShawn, she was very much so a part of Tyler Perry's beginning. And so I do believe that Tyler Perry is going to be uh, a very instrumental part of um, the, the arrangements and things of that nature. I do believe that. So um, our love goes to them. They're going to be just fine. Um, our love goes to them. And so our prayers go out to them. And so we just say that may the peace of God rest rule and abide upon their heart and their mind. You know, we just believe God for uh, for the comforter, even at this time. So I love you all. Keep the family in your prayers. And um, we send our love to them. And um, I'll talk to you guys later.